Welcome to Trading Lounge and the Bitcoin Report. Uh, I'm going to make it quite quick because I've got uh, some some work folk outside um, doing work on the roads. Um, but I just want to get this out. So yeah, from the low here, we're looking at uh, wave one with wave two uh, into play. We could also look at it as wave A and B. Um, if it was going to be an A and a B, it's still going to take us up to 50,000 where the 61.8% is. So we're going to keep an eye on the bearish count, especially when it gets up here. In the meantime, um, we're looking at wave one and two here, and then we'll look at three, four, five. So it's a pretty, you know, uh, this is basically getting ready to, you know, leave the 30,000 and, and head up to the 50 and we'll spend some time at the 40 uh, here. So it should move quite, once it gets going in here, it should move quite quickly through here. Um, yeah, you see how it, markets kind of mirror each other a little bit. We'll spend time here. It's got a pretty clean break at this point. So we should get a, a, a pretty clean break there too. And it'll also help us to work out too if it's actually a bullish count because if it's going to be a C wave coming here, at A and a B and a C, it's going to be on a bit more of a lazy angle. But if it's going to be a third wave, like wave two here and then wave two here, a third of a third, this is going to be quite strong here at some point. So it needs to let go of this a little bit. So that's going to be sort of interesting to see. Now, we're just going to go in here and have a little look at this. There's two things that we need to uh, view here. Let me just get that onto 200 and maybe get some... Oh, sorry, wrong one, 100, thinking, I, I can't, I can only do one thing at a time, unfortunately. I was sort of thinking and doing something. Um, I need to think and do the same thing at the same time. Um, so I need uh, some more information in here. I'll just get a tad more here while we're here. So we've got this wave two here, and this is our blue wave one up here, right? So... We've got this high in here. So what I wanted to say here with two things is that um, the 50-60% retracement levels down here, so the A wave, the B wave, and then we'd have to look at this as wave one here, two here, three here, four here, and five here. That's all That's all sort of doable at this point, okay? So that's one way to look at it. Uh, the other way um, is that we're actually completed already uh, here, so we've got the A wave here, A B C for the B wave that we we're talking about yesterday, and down for the C wave. There is there is a five little wave structure in here. It has nipped the low out here, so it's like it's doable, you know, um, for this. So we'll just see. So there's also this situation of having wave two here as well. So there's two ways to look at it, and um, I don't have any answers or weight to either one of them, but normally wave C would would be the same length as wave A here. So they kind of got a bit of a relationship there. I mean, not perfect, but what relationship is, um, except for the honeymoon, of course. Um, so what I want to say is that this uh, wave two here, that can pull back. That's why, does, that's why I'm making the video. I didn't want to get folks trapped because this could pull back up to into this space here and then go and then drop at that space. So we may get um, an A and a B and a C wave here and then down again. Do you know what I mean? So going long off here could be a little bit, uh, a little bit dangerous. Now, the other thing to do uh, if you're a professional uh, gambler, then you should be able to figure out if we've got five waves up here or three waves. And if it is five waves, then you take the B wave out here and then you go up from that point. If not, then you'll just have to go long high. The other point here is between 30,000 and 100, between here we've got the, the levels one, two, 300, and then 500 and then 800. So this 800 will play out um, and so will the 650 here and the 72 here. That's all part of group two there. Uh, but you know that kind of stuff. So uh, support in this area here would take us higher at that point. You know, if you're struggling with anything, then you would need to be long above the B wave at this point. Otherwise, um, yeah, that's the, the absolute safe trade if you, if you can't figure out what's going on. And uh, yeah, so that's it. It's not a very nice green, is it? I mean, it's okay, but where's my dark green? That's better. Um, so, yeah, that's the story. So do we go straight up from here? Is that the go? 
or do we just have a bit of a rally and then come down into three, four, and five here? I mean, obviously, it's a huge difference on it, on either one, um, but that's basically where we're at the moment, and that's the trade at the top there. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll anyway, we'll check it over here. We'll have time to, tomorrow. I'll, I'll have this sorted out. We'll, it should have. You know, we should see enough price action here to be able to have a stronger position and, and bring this down here further at that point, you know. Alrighty, uh, I'll leave it at that. Thanks for tuning in. Cheers. Cheers.